Hello folks, welcome to a very special episode of Ace Cam. Normally I have a lot of confidence about capturing that elusive ace on camera, but today it's at an all time high. Why you may ask? Well, because I'm playing this hole with some of the best players in the world. Welcome to Ace Cam Team TaylorMade Edition. Next up is a former world number one, a major champion, and he has 17 worldwide wins. He, well, you get the idea. It's my fair dinkum favorite Aussie, Jason Day. J Day. Yes. Hole in one. Okay. What's your thoughts? Um, did you get a hole in one? Like about a hole in one. Do you care? Do they mean anything to you? They do care. I do care about it. A hole in one is great, but they're just like, it's like a unicorn, finding, trying to find a unicorn. They're very rare. You know what right, I mean? Right, right, right. But unicorns aren't real, are they? You think, I mean, I haven't really thought about unicorns yeah. in a while. I think about hole in ones all the time. Okay. I don't know if I even have a stance. I mean, they're definitely, it's it's super lucky. Is it lucky though? How many Some do you of have? them are. I've only got four. So four? That, so my chances of, of having a hole in one here are pretty high. Yeah. Because that's been such such a long time. How long has it been? Uh, I think. Oh, actually, BMW 2015. No, 2016. Oh no, hold on. BMW 2017. Right, I remember. It was a seven iron. Seven iron. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. That was pretty good. Won a car out of it. <laughs> you still have it? No, I gave it away because someone. Uh, I like it was for. I gave the car away so a kid could go to college. Dude. Thanks. I mean, we could spend a lot of time talking about what golf's done for you, but. Oh yeah. But. I At the end of the day, it's not a product, mm. right? What is it that it's really given you? Oh, it's given me everything. I've got, I mean, it literally has given me everything. It's got my, I've, I've met my wife through it. I've got three beautiful kids. I've got my friends at home. Um, I get to play the best golf courses in the world for free, by the way, and get paid doing it, which is amazing. I get to travel the world. I get to meet interesting people like yourself, which is, which is really cool and unique. Wow. It's good, man. I wouldn't ask for anything else. Yeah. Except a hole in one right now. Exactly. Let's do it. All right. Ace, Ace cam. cam live. Now. Yeah, it's live. It's live. Ace Cam. 25 in off the left. Okay. And what are you hitting? 760 got, right now? Yeah, I've got a 760 pitching wedge. Okay. And I'm kind of going to hopefully just, if the wind isn't off, off the left, I'm going to aim it between the camera, yeah. the hole in one camera, and the flag. That's the spot. And just kind of baby, maybe a little draw and let it come back. Yeah, the wind kind of grabs it at the apex and then it just falls right behind the stick and rolls in. Yep. Okay. Flighted. Cutting back Flighted. to the stick. Just a little bit right too far right. Just a little overcut. Oh, that's pretty good, man. I'd be happy with that in tour. <laughs> You'd be really happy with that. Can we talk about your feet? What's up with my feet? Oh, it's really narrow. Is that because of your back? It's, no, 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 no. It's only because it, it feels like a chip shot to me. Whoa. I'm gonna go to school for a sec, everybody. Just hang on. I wanna watch this. Full swing? Yeah. 10 off a full swing, but flighted. More like a wedge shot. Because you got you got narrow ba uh, like base. Right. Means you can't rip at it. Right. So you gotta be controlled with your body. Right. And that you have to just swing a certain length and just be in balance. I'm about a club and a half, probably less than you, at, okay. on my best day. So I'm hitting yep. a nine, and I'm gonna put my feet together and see what happens. Yeah. I'm looking kind of where you're looking. That's yeah. so interesting. It forces you to stay left. Yeah. So come out lower. It's pretty dang good, man. That was okay. It's pretty Didn't really close. cut, but. It was perfect length. It was good, yeah. You just pulled a little bit, it's fine. All right. Let's play golf together, James. I know, this man. Is, I'm right? already pumped. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on. Oh, cut, cut, Girl. cut, cut, cut. Girl. Take it. Cut, cut. That's it. Off that slope. Come back down. This has got a hole. chance. This has got a chance. Get you momentum. So? Get momentum. What's it doing? It's too far. I didn't get enough spin on it. Just came across it. Ooh. Yeah, a little too much. That's pretty dang good. This has a chance. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Come on, curl, curl, curl. That has a chance. Come on. Is it? Is it? It's, is it going to be able to get off that? No, it's too. How close is it? You ended five feet past the hole. Oh, it's, it's just, I need to put more. So it, the greens aren't very fast right now. The I think problem that, is I, I'm hitting a knockdown shot and it's taking too much spin off it. If I'm going to land it there, I need to hit something shorter. A little more spin. A little bit more spin, but it's into the wind. And if I hit a 50, it's going to go like this and balloon and won't yeah, get there. Yeah, exactly. And it'll spin off the green. Yeah. Oh, ah, it doesn't cut. Oh, you're giving me the pulls now. That's coming. 
Yeah, slowly. Gotta get a hard bounce. Oh, no, oh, I missed it. Bounce. Dang it. You don't really even align. You just know where you're at. Well, I do align a little bit. But you, this is not for you alignment. This is actually visualization. So, you gotta ask yourself a question. You know this, you know the whole story about this. I do. You ask yourself a question. I have, I've gone away from closing my eyes to keeping my eyes open because if I go like this, what does a gentle draw pitching wedge look like? The brain will answer and I can visualize the ball going up and doing exactly what it needs to do. So it's gonna gentle draw up, hit the wind and then fade back. So this is part of your mental routine that maybe a lot of people who are watching this don't actually know about, but you're big on this part of the golf technique. Yes, I'm very, very big. Um, it's been a huge part because at the start of my career, well, when I was about 14, I shouldn't say start of my career, start of when I started, you know, taking this stuff serious as a kid, I couldn't visualize. So my coach said, you know what, you need to close your eyes. And then I met up with Jason Goldsmith one, one year and we were working on focus band and he kind of taught me a few things, which I, you know, obviously took and, and ran with. So it's been, it's been pretty good. Yeah. Oh, that's right. It's not that bad. That's pretty, pretty good. good. That's pretty good. It's got a chance. It's got to get up a little bit. Oh, ah. dude. That's nice. That's, that's one of the closer ones I've hit. That's good. That's it. That's it. That's really right there. That's it. Come on, come, come on, on, turn. Come on, come down. I didn't break, I didn't. I might have hit it through the wind. Get it there. So I got the 50, I'm changing it up. I'm gonna hit it more of a full shot there. Okay. <laughs> that is gonna spin, is but it I'm not right there. Kidding. Come on. That's landing. So I think that might be a better club. Yeah. In the end. Cut. That is working. Come on now, spin right. I've just gotta get it further right. I love that ball flight. Yeah. That's that's that is too far right. Oh, yeah, just stay there. Across. Come on, come on. Oh, that is just magnetized to the stick. You see how we uh. That's a pretty good shot there, bro. Thanks, man. You see how we um, we don't feel it right now? Yeah, back But as here. soon as, so, say for instance, we hit a chip shot underneath these trees. It's like perfect example at Augusta, right? With very similar feel. It's windy, you know it's windy because you can hear the, hear the wind whip through the trees. You keep it below the trees, not gonna get affected by the wind. Right. Get it above, yeah. even for a split second, just like just this. Tossed. But that's why you see golfers and we're always like this. What? You know what I mean? Sometimes we're looking at we're looking at the clouds, right? To see where the wind is coming from. But like you got to be careful because sometimes you could be blowing out of like the northeast and the clouds moving south. You know what I mean? So usually we're looking at the clouds or we're looking at the tops of the trees to see where the trees are moving. That feels good. Come on, Come baby. On. Come on, baby. Come on. Ah! So close. Oh, Almost jarred it back a quarter of an inch. No, come on, man. Oh, man. Oh, that was actually really good. Okay. Dang it. Just going jar. He doesn't even want any green. A little strawberry jet. That has a chance. That's good. Stay, stay on that line. No, he's moving too much. Yeah, it just starts cooking over there. Dang it. That's got a chance, Jay. Okay, now spin. Ah. Oh. Man, that is just starting in the same place every time. Close, close. Oh, no. That has a chance there, lads. If it Love stays it. in and then spin. Oh, no. Curl yeah, where right. you go? Curl right. Oh. I feel like we're, we're getting dialed. Yeah. This is just practice. We're, gel it's we're gelling right now. Now it's on. What do you want to talk about the most in your bag right now? Mm. It has to be the new driver. You like it? Yeah, yeah. Did you? So, so you're playing the Max? Yeah, I'm going to play the Max. I think I'm going to play the Max. I don't know. What did you have before? You had an M5 Tour, right? M6. You had an M6? Yeah, so it's, it's very similar to the Max. So what is it about the larger, I mean, larger head? I mean, what are you looking for? I, you see, 
in, in a driver, what am I looking for in a driver? Yeah. Um, very rarely do I go, whoa, that's a really good driver. Right now, the Max is, is off the charts. Yeah. I really like the way it's, I like the way that it's going through the air, the trajectory, the spin. Yeah. Oh, that's not gonna get. Oh. That could work, the wind is coming. Come on, push it wind. I'm getting it, tired, Jay. Yeah, it, well, it started good. When, if you're playing with somebody in a, in a tournament and it's like Saturday and it's getting kind of serious and yeah. they're not playing well, do you ever talk to them? Feel mm. bad that they're just sort of losing? Sometimes I talk to them, but not really. No, like if it's come, it's a, if Thursday, Friday, it's funny, man. Like Thursday, Friday, you should hear the range and, and like, like everyone's talking on the range, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, they're talking a little bit less and then Sunday's zero talk. Really? Si silent. Like you could hear a pin drop, it's amazing. Yeah, um, it's a different day. Yeah, it's a different day, yeah. Well, but it shouldn't be, right? Ideally. Because golf ball really doesn't know what day it is. Wow. The only thing that you know is you know what day it is. And you shouldn't treat that shot any different from Thursday's round. Yeah. Right? I mean, in that sense, do you try to incorporate, like, enjoying the game? You talked about enjoying playing yeah. nice courses. Well, yeah, that, when you say enjoying it, you've got to enjoy the moment when you get in, into the heat. Right. Like, you know, because some people like go, oh, I can't do it. Right. I like rather go hide under that tree over there. You know what I mean? Right. Uh, and not all the time you enjoy it because you don't really play that well, but that's when you learn and get better. But like you have to really enjoy the moment. Right. Your playoff percentage is it's pretty good. I don't know. I think I lost one. Yeah. How many? I don't know how many playoffs I think I've been. In. I think it's like oh, two you, or three. Yeah. I think I, it's either two or three. Um, the first one of the farmers was. Nah, yeah, I've had yeah, I've had two playoffs at the farmers, I think. And yeah. then I and lost to Billy I lost to Billy Horschel at, at the Byron. Missed a short putt and it's yeah. terrible. Sixty six percent. We'll pretty, say that. pretty dang good. That's working. Come on. Get in there. Come on. All right, last one. Okay. That was really Yeah, we can't give up on the last one though. We have to really try. Okay, I'm trying, man. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm, fo I'm focused. All right. Oh, flight it. It's flighted Pearl. straight at the camera. Come on. Go finish on a good one. I mean, you're right, that one. was not good. Even if it's on the green. Yeah. I'm just going to aim right at the stick and try to hit a straight ball. Haven't done that in a while. It's actually, let's go see it. Jay, thank you, brother. That was fun. Yeah, it was. I, I wish I could. It. I wish I could hold a, hold a, at least a shot. I mean, we well, shared an experience. Right? We shared yeah, well, an experience, I know. Which is, I know, you know we did. We we came. We became a little bit closer. It doesn't. <laughs> Should we just walk to the green? Yeah, we'll go to the green. Oh, I it's, did nearly hold jaw one. Jeez, that's close. Mm. Yeah, it just came right across the stick. Dang, Look man. at that pitch mark. Look at that. Jeez. Pretty good. Like Pepper. that on TV, everyone's freaking out. Yeah, I know. Dude, I mean, it's hard to get, you're a ball away from the hole. Yeah, I know, I'm a little bit disappointed. You're to disappointed. Yeah, I am. It's a little bit sad. That's dead. <laughs> Look at that, I mean, like. We're talking about less than a ball. If it lands here, it's in. Yeah. You know what I mean? If it lands half on the, on the, yeah, it's in. So I'm it's like, may, may, maybe a ball and a half away. Pretty crazy stuff, huh? It's good. Well, no ace today, unfortunately, but thankfully we have five other players from Team TaylorMade to take a crack at it. Will one of these pros get a hole in one on ace cam? Tune in to our other episodes to find out. <laughs>